Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I am about to start getting ready to go to the mall, which is why my hair looks like a complete mess. Um, don't mind me, my allergies are acting up this morning. I probably should have took something last night before I went to bed, but I did not, so that's my own fault. Um, I just realized when I got up that today is 9-11 like wow I did not realize that I was going to the mall on 9-11 that's kind of scary in a way because you know anything could happen which I don't want to think that way because I know that God has everything you know under control and he has a plan so I'm putting all my trust in the big guy upstairs today, and I don't mean my neighbor. I don't even know if my upstairs neighbor's a guy or a girl, so I don't mean them. I actually mean, you know, the Lord, my, you know, my personal savior. I'm putting my trust in him today, and yeah forever remembering what happened on that day. I was too little to remember exactly what I was doing because I'm only 22. So on 9-11 when that actually happened, I was too little to remember anything. So I don't remember where I was on that day or anything. And, you know, they say, you know, Oh, on that day, you remember exactly what time you were at when it all started happening. And in my case, that's not true because I was too little to to know. I was too little to, not too little to know because I'm sure, you know, wherever I was, they said something. But I was too little. Like, I don't remember. I was probably, like, in kindergarten or something. So, yeah, I don't. I don't know where I was, I don't know what I was doing at that point in time, but I'm just glad that I'm here today. And yeah, um, with that being said, I just picked on the day that I chose to go to the mall, which was a couple days ago, I just chose a day which was the best day for me to go because... Like I said, today is my best day to go because yesterday, I knew my first day off, which was yesterday, I wanted to spend it cleaning, which is what I did. And I knew on my second day off, I wouldn't be doing anything. So, I knew I could either A, sleep in, or B, convince my grandma to take me shopping at the mall. And so I can get the stuff that I want, not want, but I need. So, yeah, I chose to talk to my grandma about going to the mall, and she said yes, so here we are, and then I realized, oh crap, today's 9-11. So, yeah, with that being said, unless my grandma texts me, which she's probably not going to, we're probably still going to the mall, so... Yeah, with that being said, I don't want this vlog to be like it was yesterday, so I'm going to cut this here and get dressed, so. Okay, guys, this is my outfit, my Sprinkle Squad t-shirt, just a normal pair of blue jeans. And now, to do something with this head of hair, I don't know if I want to brush it, or if I want to brush it and throw it in a ponytail. Because of the fact that I'm going to the mall today, I'll probably put it in a ponytail. Um, yeah, so let me let me throw my hair up, and then I will talk to you guys in a little bit. I don't have much time left because it's now 8:43, and I still have to, like I said, brush my hair. But I also have to find socks, put my socks and shoes on, and I have to eat still. And I have to eat something because I'm getting hungry. So, 
I'm just gonna let you guys go and show you guys everything along the way. Alright, so I got my hair done. Threw it up in a ponytail. I got my socks, which I'm about to put on my feet. And I've got my cereal right here. Cocoa Pebbles, for those of you who want to know. And I only got a little tiny bit, because I know some of you are probably going to ask down below. Why don't you have a lot of cereal in your bowl? Like, it's so little. It's because... Apparently I have to hold this. It's because I'm not really that hungry, but I need to eat something because... Last night before I went to bed, I ate two or three bites of my sub, and whenever I do that, when I wake up, the next morning, whenever I eat, right before I go to bed, whenever I wake up the next day, I always have this um, nauseous feeling to where if I don't eat right away, I'm gonna, you know, get sick. So, that's why I have a, that little tiny bit of cereal. I'm gonna eat that. And I'm going to bring a couple, like, breakfast bars with me so if I get hungry on the way or on the way home, then I can eat that. Um, I'm going to stop talking and put my socks and shoes on and eat this bowl of cereal because, whoo, this girl's tummy is turning and I feel like I'm going to throw up, so I need to eat. Hi! We just got here. Parked in that parking garage thing. back in the dressing room too. I'm trying to quiet. Trying one size bigger of these jeggings and these jeggings because the first two size jeggings were size 14. Let me tell you, they fit perfectly, but they were, as you can probably tell, were a little snug around the belly and these ones fit perfectly. So I'm getting the size 16 in the jeggings. Hey guys, we are currently eating at the Cheesecake Factory. I have water. We have bread right now. And I'll show you the bags and stuff later because there's music playing and I don't want to get YouTube banned. So, I'll be back later. Bye! Alright guys, we came outside to the car. Ah, my armpit to put our stuff, well, my stuff, in the car. Oh, here comes Grandma. Because my shoulder was hurting, plus we have leftover food, so I wanted to put that in the car too. And now we're going back in to look at a couple more stores, and then we are going, believe it or not, it's already like 1.30 in the afternoon, <laughs> and we've been here since like 10 something, so let the shopping continue. And just like that, I am back at home. Um. After the last clip that you saw, I think you saw Grandma and I um, going back into the mall to get a couple of things. See, I just wanted, after we ate, I wanted to stop at what's called the Christmas store. So we stopped there, and then after we left there, the only other place that I wanted to go was Doughboys, which for those of you who do not know, it is um, a store where you can buy edible cookie dough. And I went there because I wanted to bring home some cookie dough, which I have. I put it inside of my refrigerator, which I actually should take out of this bag. I'll show you what I got. I got red velvet cookie dough, which I actually have not tasted yet, to be honest. And chocolate chip cookie dough, which, if you can see the side, I ate a little bit of it in the car. Which, just for you guys, 
I'm gonna try this for the first time. Because I have not tried this kind before. But I heard it's really good. Comes with little spoons. Mmm. Red velvet cookie dough is delicious. Mmm. I better stop eating this. <laughs> That's good. Mmm. That is real good. Oh, shoot. I dropped my cookie dough. But luckily, there's a top on it. Okay. There's that. And I'm not going to show you guys trying me the... I'm not going to show you guys me trying the other cookie dough because I've had that. Like I said, I had it in the car and it's really good. Um, so, yeah, I went to the Christmas store. And the one thing that's in here I cannot show you because it is a Christmas present, but... The other thing I got, I'm going to give to John right away. I had to get it. Well, it's kind of for John, but it's kind of like, honestly, for the both of us. Minnie and Mickey. Which I can't really talk too loud because he's right there in the other room, but this is what it says. And when I seen that the first time, I'm like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. And then, like, I was debating. I walked around the whole store. And I'm like, do I get it? Do I not? Do I get it? And then I was going to walk out of the store without buying it. Without buying anything, actually. And I'm like, I got halfway to the door. And I'm like, I have to buy that for him. Like, I just have to. Um... The other thing I got for him, I'll have to go get it. I left it in the bedroom when I was in there with talking to him. I got a couple shirts. Oops. From Victoria's Secret. I got this one that is gray. I've got this one that is maroon and for those of you who are about to pause this video and say hold on I can't see the shirt hold on people because this girl is gonna do a fashion show for you guys I also went to Build-A-Bear no I did not build a bear but that's because for those of you who know I already have one her name is Isabella and John and I made her when John and I went to Pennsylvania when we went to Splash Lagoon with my sister. And I got her her very own Halloween costume. And I will show you. It is a witch. Witch. Ha, see what I did there? Anyways, seriously. Um, I will put her in this as well. So then you guys can see what she looks like wearing this. Which I'm going to do that after I am done. And then I got sneakers. They are from Payless. And they have the memory foam in the bottom. So that is a major plus for me. And... These shoes were on sale. Buy one, get the second one. I don't remember how much off, but the um, these shoes are $39.99. And the second pair of shoes was only $15, which the second pair was for my little cousin because she wanted a pair of shoes as well. So when my grandma and I went to the mall, she specifically told my grandma that she wanted black and pink. So we were looking throughout the whole entire mall, black and pink, black and pink, black and pink. Or she wanted just black or just pink. 
so but she really wanted black and pink so we were looking through the whole mall and finally the last shoe store that we went to was payless and they had these ones and i tried them on i tried on the eights and they were too tight for me but her she is younger than me which means her foot is not as long as mine um so she my grandma got the eights for her i got the eight and a halfs for myself because her foot is as wide as mine but it's not as long as mine so the eights will be a little bit big on her but she will grow into them so my grandma got her the eights i got these eight and a halfs and yeah i cannot wait to actually wear these shoes i am so excited because now I have two pairs of shoes instead of just one. See, I was going to get, um, I was going to get two pairs of sneakers for myself. But the other shoes, they did not have the other kind that I liked. So I just got those ones because there were no other ones there that I actually liked. And I've got these jeans from American Eagle which like I said I will do a fashion show so you guys will see these other pairs of jeans they're kind of the same but they are a little bit lighter so there's these ones which besides these ones right here being a little bit lighter these first ones these first ones are I don't know what they are because I accidentally ripped off the tag already Oh, skinny jeans. Okay, so these first ones are um, skinny jeans. And these second ones are super soft jeggings. So these ones are jeggings, which jeggings are kind of, for those of you who don't know, like leggings, but they're jeans. And another thing is, is they're kind of like skinny jeans, but um, they're not. And I got another pair of jeggings, and these ones are dark. And I've got two flannels, which I got this one, and I've got this one. And we also went to the Yankee Candle store. And I got uh, this. John doesn't know. It is this. It is a, um, for the car. It's an air freshener. And for me, Yankee Candle, I also got this giant bag because the bags were getting heavy when I was carrying them so I got that and I also got something else from Yankee Candle besides what I just showed you so hang on a second all right I'm back I got this candle for John which he knows about this I showed it to him already um for John as well and it is actually called crisp fall night I don't know if you can see that um, well, I know you can see it. I just don't know if it's backwards. And for those of you who do not like false, like fall scents all that much and like don't like pumpkin or whatever, this is different. Like I wish you guys could like smell through the cam camera, but you know, of course you can't. This, the smell, fall smell, it's not strong and it smells really good. And take this from me because... Like, as soon as that John smelled it, he's like, I thought you didn't like fall smells. I don't, guys. I don't. I hate. Hate is a strong word. I strongly dislike fall smells. Like, I've never found a scent that I like fall smells. I don't like apple smells that much. I strongly dislike pumpkin. Like, no go for me. No go for me. But when I see this something called out to me and I'm like can I open the top and smell that except there was the smaller one of this and she goes yeah you can open that and smell it so I said okay so I opened the top and I'm like 
Ha. Oh, this smells really good. I said, and normally I don't like fall smells. I could never find a fall smell that I like. But guys, Yankee Candle has it. It's called Crisp Night Fall. If you don't like fall smells and you go to a Yankee Candle store, find this one and smell it. Because guaranteed, you will probably like it. And... Yeah, honestly, that's all I got. So I'm going to do a fashion show now. So let's get to it. And action for the little fashion show. Here is Isabella. Rocking her cute little witch hat and her little witch dress. And let's do the turn, Isabella. Do, do, do. So there's Isabella, and sorry, like, I don't care what you guys say, that was cute, near and dear to my heart, so cute. Now, for me. Alright, and just so you guys know, I purposely don't have all of these buttons done up in the flannel because I'm just doing a little, you know, modeling, so. Got this tank top, or tank top, yeah, this flannel which I bought at Old Navy. So this flannel right here that I'm wearing right now was bought at Old Navy. And I got... <coughs> I'm trying to figure out how to show you guys the jeans now. These jeans... I hope you guys can see them okay. These jeans... These are the jeggings. They're just dark colored. Alright, there's this one, which I'll show you, hang on, which I bought this flannel also from American Eagle, where I bought the jeans. Um, I did not change my jeans yet, it's just my top. So I'm still wearing the dark jeans. So what? tell me what you guys think about flannel number two. I bought this top, which is maroon top, from Pink, aka from um, Victoria's Secrets, and I've got the different pair of jeans on. Let me see if I can. We got this shirt, which it just says pink, as you guys can see, and it has the sparkly stuff down here. And then there's these jaggings. So tell me what you guys think about outfit number three. Which, and obviously this shirt could go with any of the pants. And like, you know, I can mix and match, mix and match like the shirts. So there's this outfit. Tell me what you guys think about this one. And last but not least, the top I got from Victoria's Secret, like I said before, and the bottoms I got from Ohm, Abercrombie and Fitch. <gasps> I think it's Abercrombie and Fitch. Yes, Abercrombie and Fitch. So here's this. It just says pink, and it has the dog, and it says, I think it says 83 on the bottom. Nope, 86 it says on the bottom. So this is the shirt. And then these are the pants. Very similar to the other light pair, but... Like I said, these are more like actual je regular jeans. And not only that, um, these ones are looser than the jeggings. So that is the difference. Um, let me actually show you, because I forgot I have this mirror right here my top better in this mirror. There you go. See, it says pink and it has the dog and then it says 86. Which, I don't know for you guys if it's backwards or not. So, there's that. Um, yeah, and that's everything that I got from the mall. Um, let me show you a better like these sneakers that I got there's memory foam in them 
This is the side view of what they look like. This is the top. This is the bottoms. And like I said, um, those are really comfortable and I cannot wait to wear them. I'm honestly probably, I don't know, I'm debating whether or not I'm going to wear those today. Because I'm actually going to be going on a walk here pretty soon. I have to get a hold of my friend. And see if she's ready to go. In the meantime, I'm going to leave all my stuff right here on my couch. Because... John wants me to show him everything that I got later, so I got to do a little fashion show again later. For him, though, not for you guys, sorry. Um, yeah, so I'm going to take this stuff off, which I'm going to honestly wash all of this before I actually wear it for the day. So all this is after I show John is going to go inside of my dirty laundry um, pile. Which will add more to the dirty, which will add more to the dirty laundry pile, but that is okay because with me I cannot just buy clothes from like the mall or any store, no matter where I buy clothes from. Like I have to wash them before I wear them. It is a thing with me because I have sensitive skin, and actually this just being on me right now talking to you guys is really really irritating me, and I just want to scratch. <laughs> So, I'm going to stop talking to you guys and get this off and get my regular clothes back on because, like I said, my back is getting very itchy and irritated right now. Alright, so, I got my backpack on, I got my wallet in there, both of my wallets. I am waiting for my friend Kaya to get here now, so I'm just gonna sit and relax until she gets here. Her and I are going to be walking, oops... No, go. There we go. Her and I <coughs> are going to be walking to Tops so I can get some um, stuff so I can make my um, buffalo chicken wing dip. Um, yeah, and I only have seven minutes left on this, so I am not taking the camera with us. I will show you everything I got when I get back. So, until I get back. Alright guys, I'm back home. I've been home for maybe about like an hour or two. I only, I got stuff to make my buffalo chicken wing dip. And I got an ice cube tray. And I got some of those and some of those. And then the other stuff that I got was stuff to make my buffalo chicken wing dip. Which I made one batch of right here. So, that makes me happy. I'm excited. I eat a little bit of it. I'm probably going to eat more in a little bit. So, yeah, I've been... What I did when I first got back home is Kaya, my friend, she stayed here with me for a little bit and we played my Wii U. And then after she left is when I was talking on the phone to one of my other friends. And me and this person stayed on the phone for like over an hour. And while I was talking to them is when I made my buffalo chicken wing dip. And I just got off the phone with them because I had to go to the bathroom. And I did not want to go to the bathroom with them on the phone with me. So I just got off the phone with them. And yeah. That's pretty much it. Um, John actually should be eating up now, so I want to do um a niche. <laughs> I want to do um a little fashion show for him, so I am going to put you guys down. There's four minutes left and then this is going to be done, so yeah, um what I'm gonna do for the rest of the night, honestly, after he leaves is I'm going to pick up this living room. Because it looks like the mall exploded in here. So, I'm going to pick up my mess. And then, honestly, I'm probably going to play the PlayStation for a little bit and go to sleep. 
I mean, the latest I'll probably stay up is, sorry about that light, the latest I'll probably stay up is, like, maybe one until John calls, but that's about it. Um, I'm going to edit this vlog after, well, maybe before I clean so then I can put it up, but I don't know. Um, I have to, oh yeah, I should do that because I have to not only do this one, but, um, I also have to put in the description the link to the um the link to the Darien Lake Laser Light Show so be on the lookout for that in the description below if you want to watch that look in the description below it will say Laser Light Show um Darien Lake Laser Light Show 2018 in the description below with the link that should be the first link I'll put it as the first link and then all the other links are my social media so definitely go down there in that description take a look at that um just so you guys know i started a um s m u l e channel which is an app for those of you who do not know and it is a oops it is a singing app I actually bought the month VIP so I can do any song that I want to. Um, that's just my name. So I will put that, I will add that to my description of things. So I haven't been on in like a couple of days because I've been, you know, I was busy. So I'm going to maybe do some songs tonight or tomorrow or sometime. I don't know. Um, so... Yeah, like I was saying, I'm going to get off of here, look in the description, and click on the Laser Light Show link that's down below. And, yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for going to the mall with me. Thanks for watching my mini fashion show. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.